morning starts with making DVDs. Something I was supposed to have done months ago, I think. And writing cards. Right. And writing cards. Yeah. Shannon's writing a card. It's got this weird glare with a cute elephant on it. And I'm burning DVDs, and we're going to go to the post office and do all kinds of stuff. I don't know if all kinds of stuff, but we're going to go to the post office and pick up some supplies and things. <sighs> Here we go. All right, so we got our supplies. We got some jacks and a wheelbarrow and... Barrow? Barrow? Wheelbarrow? I don't know how to say the right wheelbarrow. word. Wheelbarrow. I guess. Now we're going to go to Myers and get stuff, and then back to the house. Easter flowers acquired, so now we've got that. And carrot cake. And carrot cake, I guess. Well, with Shannon gone, off to a party. It's time to get started putting together my wheelbarrow. Uh, so I'll get my tools out. I guess I'll just get to work. Instructions, and it looks like I'm assembled it had assembled this backwards because now when I take this guy and Stick him on over here it Still doesn't line up, but these guys will bend because they're on the far side And so I just had it 180 degrees backwards <sighs> Assembling these things is always One wheelbarrow, ready for a year's worth of work, hopefully. <laughs> it kind of goes together weird, so I'm hoping that all the parts are there, as well as I have extra screws, which is always fun. <laughs> Anyways, it rolls and works, so I now have a new tool. Anyways, now that I got a shiny new wheelbarrow, I figure let's put her to work for the first time and take an attack at this section over here which has just got built up stuff down in there and I really need to pay attention to that window because that's a point where mice and whatnot can get in and in fact I know have gotten in so I need to spend some time in down in that area I'm down in the hole here and this is a fine find look at this I don't know what the hell this is but it goes right up into the house right there so there's a piece of Romex so electrical cable just disappearing into the ground right there why? <laughs> Doug, you scare me. Uh, I'm going to get my tools and see if it's live or not. And if it's not, I'm going to cut it out. So down in the hole uh, still, and I checked this guy out, and I have one of these little little meter things that basically says if something's hot or not, it blinkity blinks, and it's hot. But I don't know what it goes to. Um, the only thing that's out here is the garage. Uh, I think at one point in time, straight ahead at the end of the path, there was a light. And possibly that's what that is, but possibly it's the garage. And I like having power out in the garage, and this doesn't seem to be an immediate danger. <sighs> it's an immediate danger. But I need to figure out what this is, and if I can get rid of it. <sighs> but I don't want to kill the power to the garage. I think this is something I'm going to punt down the road for a later date. Well, the wheelbarrow works great. Kind of cleaned up over here. Picked up a bunch of stuff. And then I walked around the house and picked up old uh, accent lights. I mean, kind of like that little accent light right there. But old ones that, you know, you have to plug in and stuff. 
So I tore those out all around the house. So they didn't work anyway, so they were already kind of trash. I got a little bit of sun left. I'll play around a little bit. Mm -hmm. 